Hi, if you like the video, please remember to subscribe. Hi, my name is Rob from RobNoFo.com and today we're going to have a quick look at a little problem that you may well have on your Google um, Samsung Galaxy Nexus Android smartphone in the fact that if you like listening to podcasts but if you like watching video podcasts you may well have come across a problem and that problem is the fact that the built-in Google Player which is, he said, because he doesn't use it very often, Google Listen, which is the kind of built-in um, um, podcast catcher, RSS listener, if you like, doesn't support video podcast, which is a bit of a bummer, isn't it? Um, and uh, here we go. There are no audio items in this feed. Let me take a step backwards, actually. I'm getting ahead of myself, aren't we? This is the uh, Twit Photo RSS feed. If you're into photography and you don't listen to or watch Twit Photo, you need your head examining because it is brilliant. The, uh, uh, you've got Leo Laporte on there, who's like Mr. Nice Guy, Mr. Radio uh, Commentator, who, who's really, really good. But then you have... Um, the lady who really runs it called uh, Catherine who's a pro photographer who asks all the right questions but the stars are the guests they have on and the images they share so although it's great to listen to Twit Photo it's even better to watch it but if you've got an Android phone and you uh, you know you Google listen you can't because you can't subscribe to video podcasts now there are paid solutions that you can buy that will uh, do that as well but they you know if you want to you know, we like free don't we with android <laughs> we, we, we like free stuff um and obviously you could watch them live off the website which is great but what happens when you want to watch one on the train or somewhere where there's no data connection or if like me you're on a restricted data plan you don't want to be watching a hundred megabyte video over your data plan you want to be downloading it separately having it on the phone and watching it at your ledger so you're downloading it on wi-fi and the answer to all of this is a little free program called Podkicker. And with Podkicker, which is free, just search the Android Marketplace for it, what you can do is you can, you can find RSS feeds and you can subscribe to RSS feeds. And then when you want to, you can then download the video. So it won't do it automatically. You, you tell it to. Let, let me show you an example. Right? So, um, what you can do is you hit the options and you could put um, subscribe and then you can find podcasts. So you can search for a podcast and it will come up. So, um, the, the, I've got the ones I want though, so I don't really need to do that. But if I go into like Twit Photo and Video Small, here we go. This is the RSS feed from that. Um, it's not the actual files, it's not the actual video, it's just the feed, so it's telling me, it's like a it's like a menu of what they've got on to offer. And if I press here, and go into refresh, let's see if there's anything new on the Twit Photo video feed. This might take a couple of seconds, because I'm on Wi-Fi and I'm at the wrong end of the house to do it properly. Anything new would pop up and be in white. Now as you can see, because I've watched a few of them already, um, they're, they're, they're kind of in bright white, and the ones that I've... Um, downloaded are in grey but let's say it popped up and this one here Celeb Proto Micro Greco so I could tap on that and it tells me what it is and then I've got download so I can download that to store it now I could stream it if I wanted but I can download it so now if I go into my da if I did choose to download I go into my downloads and here we have my different things so let's have a see what we've got so we've got Twip Photo 52 so let's tap on that Let's, and it says choose a player to watch it on. So I'm going to choose Podkicker because the built-in and there is no built-in Android. And there we go. Right now, I'm just going to skip through this. Let me talk a little bit about Squarespace.com, the secret behind exceptional So there we are. I'm not going to play it all. <laughs> YouTube is very good at finding duplicate content and then saying that I'm copying it. Hopefully that's fair use. But what else have we got in here? We've also got The Art of Photography, which is another Everybody nice video one. Back to another episode of The Art of Photography. There we go. One thing that's very helpful is it, uh, Fantastic. Is the time spent on the website. So, as far as I'm concerned, this is probably the perfect video solution because it enables me to, to subscribe to video podcasts 
like Dtown TV, and then I can look at the RSS feed, and if I want it, I can download it, and it will download them only over Wi-Fi. I'm not sure if I can s- I set that up. No, no, the, with the PodKick, what is it? I would only ever download it over Wi-Fi because it won't download stuff automatically. So in the evening, I can just refresh my feeds, download them, and then I can watch them at work or wherever I like because they're already on my phone, and I'm not risking a big data bill. So, just to kind of go over that once again, if you need to listen to, well sorry, to watch video podcasts on your Galaxy Nexus, and you run into the problem that um, the uh, Google RSS reader doesn't handle video, and you don't want to have to pay for one, get PodKicker because it does it perfectly the player is great and it works for me the only thing it doesn't do is if you leave the app halfway through it doesn't remember where you were but most video podcasts aren't that long are they so you can just click back into it and I've been very very impressed and it's perfect because it means that I choose when I want to download not the the phone choosing so I can choose to do it when I'm on Wi-Fi when I'm at home and then I can watch them at my pleasure so there we go get pod kicker subscribe to twit photo d town um art of photography you, you know trays variety hour all those sorts of video podcasts and watch them without having to worry about your data plan um it works very very well that's pod kicker in the android marketplace my name is rob from robnonphoto.com thanks for watching <laughs>